The ministerial code says that ministers who knowingly mislead Parliament will be expected to offer their resignation. Does the Prime Minister believe that applies to him? Prime Minister. Mr Speaker, of course, but let me tell the House uh, that I think he's inviting a question about uh, an investigation which, as uh, you know, Mr Speaker, I can't uh, comment. I think the Prime Minister said yes, he agrees the code does apply to him. Uh, 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 and therefore, if he misled Parliament, he must resign. Yes. On the 1st of December, the Prime Minister told this House, in relation to parties during lockdown, all guidance was followed completely in number 10 from that dispatch box. Yeah. On the 8th of December, it looks quizzical, he said it. Yeah. On the 8th of December, the Prime Minister told this House, I have been repeatedly assured since these allegations emerged there was no party. Yeah. So since he acknowledges the ministerial code applies to him, will he now resign? Yeah. 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 No, Mr. Speaker. And it's precisely because we didn't listen to Captain Hindsight uh, that we have the fastest growing economy in the G7, Mr Speaker, and we have got all the big calls right. This is the guy that said in hindsight he now appreciates it was a party. <laughs> we, we, we've discovered the real Captain Hindsight, haven't we, Mr Speaker? Let me spell out this. Let me spell out. They shout now. They're going to have to go out and defend some of this nonsense. <laughs> when he talks about the most serious issue before uh, the public today and before the world today. It's almost as though he was in ignorance of the fact, uh, Mr. Speaker, that we have a crisis on the borders of Ukraine. And I, and, and I, can, I can tell him. I can tell him what is actually what is going on in the cabinet room of this country is that the UK government. No, Mr. Speaker. The UK government is bringing the West together so that we have. Can the Prime Minister confirm that he will publish the full Sue Gray report as he receives it? Minister. Mr. Speaker, what I can tell him is that we've got to leave the report to the independent uh, investigator, as he knows. Uh, and of course, uh, when I receive it, I, of course, I will do exactly.